kind of hard to get to this clip. Welcome back to another episode of We Be Bills. Today, what we're gonna do, we're gonna see how much parts we can take off of this thing today. Because once we done take off all the parts that we need, we're gonna start install everything on this one and then see if we could switch. But first, what we're gonna do is just take off, see if how far we could get. We're gonna take off the headlights, the front assembly, and all of that. See how fast we're gonna get to that. Uh, while doing that, we're gonna see if we can put up, set up a little tent. So, because it's very hot out here, it's already um, set, uh, 78, going to 80 degrees. So it should get to a max of 110 today in Arizona. So, less talking, let's hop straight into the video. Like, share, subscribe, drop it, drop, drop in the comments and thoughts down below. Turn your post notifications on. Don't forget, check us out on WeWeGoods.com. And don't forget to, to grab yourself some merch and support the channel. Anyways, share. Share, 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 and keep sharing the videos because uh, it helps build the channel and hit the like button. Hey, but anyways, let's hop straight into this video. Okay, so we finally got to put up the finally got to put up the tent so now that's done what we're gonna do now is try to get everything off so I'm gonna put y'all in a quick time lapse so what I'm gonna do first we're gonna try to pull off everything right here on the front but as you can see there's a crack right here so it is a, a little bit of damage on the driver's side headlight but you can see from where it got hit it pushed in right on this side so we're not going really to worry too much about it because you can see a little bit of the bumper is kind of bulging out so we're going to try to take the bumper off and then go from there so i'm going to put you on a time lapse so you can see everything all right so what we're gonna do right now we're gonna take off the front wheel and then we're gonna take out all of these um take out all of these clips right here and then we should be able to remove here on and this for the headlight but right here there are two screws right here and once we take out these two screws that are right here we should be able to basically pull the bumper out and then the clip there's some clips right here but we're just gonna have to take our time i'll show you how to get those out because i did it on the other side and kind of went good but it's just a whole bunch of clips i kind of end up breaking one of them so uh let's get to it i'll put you on a quick time lapse so we could get it done Don't you know that I 
okay so now we got all these clips out so as you can see I just basically use this tool to get it out once I basically pry them up so now there's a clip that's right in here so what I'm gonna do is to get the clip out right all I gotta do that's all you gotta do is basically pry up a little bit as you can see there's a whole bunch of dust behind here so the next thing is there's some other clips behind so there's gonna be some clips behind here as you can see that's one right there what I did um, on the other side I basically try to pull but there's probably an easier way to remove these clips so what I did was kind of like pull down a little bit and then got the clips out right so I just basically pulled it off the little slot that it has but there's also another way to do it but the, the, the windshield washer bottle is in my way so what I'm gonna do is just keep pulling so I got the second one off so now for this one it's gonna kind of be a little bit hard but I gotta pull out a little bit and then I pull that one out so this one I still got to do the same pulling but take your time that's what I'm doing so I don't break any of these clips so so I've been doing good so far so the other ones that are that side you got to push down okay so before you could start like pulling this way down to the car this thing right here you have to turn it uh, so what I did I'll just get this needle nose and just hold on to it and turn it and then that's it So now on this side it's kind of weird but I'm gonna try to take my time so I don't break anything but now remember we had to pull this way to take these off so I'm pushing this way to see if I could get these out or let me see if moving this will help me to push my hand back there and re remove the clips yes it look like I forgot one This should be another easy way. See if this could work.
break this one same thing I did on the other side kind of broke this one I said I want to leave it, but they just press for it and it come out, you know. Oh, 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 okay. Hmm? Yeah, we broke one of them on the side, you know. See when we broke over this side, see when we broke over here, so. That's how you do it, but you see, I broke this one again. Same thing I did on the other side. So, right in here. For, for the, those two bolts are like 10 millimeters so you're just taking these ones out this one right here and then you should be able to pull the bumper down so if we're going to take those two out and then slightly pull the bumper down this is a clip that um was in here that was connected in here inside of the bumper so how to release it there's a clip you just press it and once you press it you push you push this piece up and then you should be able to pull it out so now that we've got those screws unbolted we should be able to pull it down oh so there's a clip inside it's kind of hard to get to this clip It's, it's one last clip that's behind the fender. So the clip that I'm talking about is right here so that's the clip that I need to get out and then it should just basically slide out okay so now that this so this is the the clip that I was talking about so now that it's out what I'm gonna do right now as you can see I'm taking this is a 10 bolt that that's holding holding the headlight in the bottom so I'm gonna remove that right now and then once I'm done then we'll go up top So now I'm gonna move this one and this one and then we should be able to take out the headlight. They're under the bottom we have some bolts under there. I think it's like a T I wanna say it's a T25 or a T30 to get those bolts off. Alright, so these are the bolts that I was talking about. So it should be a T30. So I got a T30 right here. So I'm going to remove all of them. Should be one, two, three on this side and three on the other side. I want to say these th these two, but I'm not completely sure. But I'm going to just remove everything and then just keep going. 
Okay, so now that we um, remove those bolts from underneath, the next thing is, so here, this piece here is just like a clip that fits in, goes over here. All you have to do, all we have to do is just went under and just pull it up, as you can see the clip, and then pull it up and then this piece comes down. So now we're ready for the whole bumper to come, to come down. So we're gonna see how it goes. Okay, so this headlight, since it's broken, I'm gonna try to see if I can take it off or keep it off the body of the car. One headlight right there. I'm trying to see what else is holding on. It is bumper. So now that the other three, the other six screws are out. Okay. Put in. So boom, the bumper is on. So the other three that I was talking about was these three right here. The clips, I didn't bother to take them out. And then the last three was to connect, um, connect to the, the engine bottom shield or whatever that call is. And then that's the clip for the bumper. So now all of this is out, we're gonna move it. And then we could, start on this piece and then see if we can fit it onto the other car so what I'm gonna do right here we can move four bolts so you got one in the corner over here two three and then you have one behind the frame and then one more on the bottom and then these these two out so on both sides, I'm gonna put you on a quick time lapse and then we're gonna just hop straight into it and keep pushing. Let's go.
Okay, so that's gonna be a wrap for today's episode on Wii Wii Bills. As you can see, we took off plenty of stuff off the other car. The bumper, as you can see right here, we took off the reinforcement bar and all of that stuff. So next episode, I'll probably try to see if I could um, get that done, put it back on. Um, but what I'm gonna try to do, eat not well, what I'm gonna try to do for the next episode, I'm gonna make sure that we can take all those, the other parts off, like the, the bad, the things that are bad. So like for instance, like this compressor right here, it's still good, but this tab right here is broken. So because this tab right there is broken, I could have just changed out this little sensor just, and then pull it out and put a new and pull the other one. But I just decided to change the whole compressor. The only difference is this has 9,000 miles. The other one has about 44,000 miles. So a couple of the things that I, I will try to get off that car, I'm gonna get it on this car. So, but apart from that, anyways, like, share, subscribe, drop your comments and thoughts down below. Turn your post notifications on. Don't forget to grab yourself some merch from WeWeBills.com. Hey, uh, thank you guys for watching this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay positive, stay motivated, and guess what? We out.